Happy New Year, everybody. It's your boy. Found some cool shit at the gun show the other day. If you just got in here, if you're just checking out this video, go ahead and hit that like button, man. Go ahead and hit that subscribe, notification game. Let's stay up in here. Let's stay locked in together. Go ahead and hit that notification. Go ahead and hit it. Come on. Let's all do it together. Let's take a minute and hit that subscribe button, man. Happy New Year's, man. Salute to everybody out there, man, that made it to another year, man. And I salute twice to all the fallen soldiers and all the fallen ladies that didn't make it to this year, man. Because a lot of us didn't, man. A lot of us didn't. We're here. Enjoy that shit, man. Found some cool ass stuff at the gun show the other day. And my first find was these bullets. I've never seen these bullets before. I've never seen these before. If you've seen these before, let me see if I can see that. There you go. If y'all seen these before, if y'all shot them before, let me know. Let me know. Let me know what you think about them in the comments, man. Because it was pretty dope. You know, it kind of got my attention. Never seen them before. You know, 13, 12 feet per second, 108 grain. I ain't never seen them before. So I figured, look, I'll pick them up. That's why I love the gun shows, man. I love gun shows because I find a lot of stuff at gun shows that I can't find in like, your local gun store. You ain't just ain't gonna find it at the gun store, man. It's too many tables, too many vendors, too many people got different shit that, that, that your gun store just ain't got. Right? So that's why I stay there. Right? Makes sense? Yeah, so, man, I picked these on up. And uh, there's this other guy that walked up beside me, man. And he was looking at them also, man. We both kind of was like, what the hell? I like them. They hollows. I can't go wrong with hollows. All right? Some nice hollows. Silver. I thought it was cool. So I picked up a box of 20. I picked up a nice little box of 20. I'm going to take them to the range. Do some ballistics on them. See what they're working with. You know? Before I really, like, try them out and keep them as my home defense weapons. Actually, it's the mug I was doing a little bit of work before I started recording. But anyway. Yeah, man. So... Let me load up. Let me let me load up a mag. Real quick. Let me load up a mag. Real quick. Did I bring one in here? I think I brought it. Yeah, I did. So man, yeah, I was down there, John. I seen this flamethrower. I'm gonna get this damn flamethrower, man. They got the damn flamethrower. I seen it. I'm getting one. I think they wanted like six hundred for the flamethrower. It's like three hundred for the pack. I mean, the flamethrower was tight, so man. You know, the backpack. They had the straps for the backpack. That was like three hundred by itself. Then it had the actual flamethrower that you can, like, mount it under your AR-15, like a grenade launcher. I'm getting that one. Oh, your boy Luzo's getting that. Yeah, I'm getting that. I'm getting that. I'm 900 for a nice little, the whole little setup. Oh, I'm getting that. You better stop playing. You think I ain't? You feel me? If I would have, man, I wish I would have seen it before I... Before I spent all my money in that thing. I wish I would have seen it before I before I even got to spending money on that thing. You know what I'm saying? I got a couple things in here that I bought from the gun show. Not it's not all in here, because if I'm not mistaken, some stuff's still in the car. But I just wanna, you know, y'all know when I go to gun show, man, I gotta show you guys some what I got. So these these hollow points, man. These nice little cute little hollow points. These little, these little cute little hollow points. These are dope. They look dope. Let me know if y'all seen them before. Let me know. I ain't never seen them. But yeah, man. I slide them right here. Some nice little... In my, in my, in my 26. I slide in my 26. Yeah, nice little home defense jump. So I'm gonna damn sure go take these to the range. Test them out. See how they are. If they, if they good enough to add to my home defense um, arsenal, my home defense weapons and bullets. You know, if it's, if it's, if it's dope enough to add. But we gonna see. Oh, we definitely gonna see, man. So that's, that's just the, the nice bullets I got. I don't even know what it's about, like I'm gonna keep saying. But we'll see, what it, we'll see what it is, man. Everybody hit that like button, man. Hit that like button while you ain't here, man. 
Go ahead and hit that like button when you watch this video. Please do that for me. So, uh, like I said, I got a couple more things I, I, I grabbed at the gun show. Let me show you. I got the ETS mags. Nice little, uh, what's the ETS, right? Yeah. Yeah, the ETS shows. I'm tripping. So I picked up two of these just to see. I heard some, I heard a lot of stuff about the ETSs that they, you know, they're not reliable. I said, you know, but see, I don't listen to a lot of, a lot of people, man. A lot of people just be listening to other people and they got the information from somebody else and that got the information from somebody else that don't even know what the hell they was talking about. Cause they got that information from someone else that just made that shit up and it just keep on going. And that's why I don't listen to nobody. I, I don't listen to nobody with shit. So I said, I'm gonna pick up two of these. I got the blue one. Got the nice blue ETS in there. 32 round mag. Should have got a couple more just in case. They are nice. So I picked up the blue one and I picked up the clear smoke gray. Yeah, it's pretty dope. It looks nice out of this 26 though, because you know, got the gold barrel. Looks pretty, looks pretty dope. But yeah, so I picked these up, man. Let me know, you know, how the ETS is working for you. I see a lot of people with them. You know, I just ain't never bought one myself at all. So I will be checking them out. And if I like them and they work and they're reliable, and because I'm going to bang the hell out of them now, I'm going to put some rounds to them now. If they work it, I'll get some more. You know, it's not even that hard to figure that out. It's not even that hard to figure that out. So, um, what else I get? I think some. The rest of the stuff is in the car. Got me some thirty-eight supers for my nineteen eleven. Nineteen eleven shoot thirty-eight supers. So I just went over and picked me up with a fifty pack of those, like forty bucks, a little fifty pack, right? And these are plus P's. Yeah, thirty-eight super plus P. So I shoot. I used to, so these are, let me show you. I got some other ones I shoot out of my drone. And I picked up some. So these are the ones that's in my 19 of now. These are, damn, what's the name of them? Something wood. And these things are, these are penetrators or something. Damn, what's the name of them? The penetrators or something. But these things are crazy. You see these little channels right there? Oh, let me see. See the little gaps right there? You see that? Yeah, that's for when it goes inside of your body. The blood can flow through that channel and rip your insides the fuck up. Hit that like button. That's what that is for. Yeah. The blood can just keep going through. The blood is not stopping that, you know, not giving off any tension. Yeah, no resistance. So I picked these up. These are some hollows for my 38 Super. For my 1911. Yeah. So you know I had to get a bag of those. So I stayed with that 1911. I stayed, I stayed strapped with that puppy. So let me see what these is. Feet per second. These are 1350 feet per second. 1350 feet per second. 38 Super. Hollow points plus P. Yeah, so you, if you know what plus P is, God damn it, you know, you know. Plus pressure, plus power, plus pow. Yeah, plus penetration, plus whatever the hell you want to put the, to make the P stand for, it's going to be plus that. That's what it's going to be. But I like the Hortonese, man. I like the Hortonese. It's 124 grain. Um, I always like Hortonese. These, what do they say? XT hollow points? I always like these. So, picked up a couple of those. A nice little 50 pack. I'm gonna try those out at the range. See what those are about. All right, so, um, I picked me up some more nine millies. I picked me up some more nine millies. Uh, what is these, 115 grain? 115 grain. And what they say here? This is 1150 feet per second. Yep, 150, 115 grain, 
1150 feet per second. Yeah, so, you know, it came with the whole canister and everything. So I got me a, a 250, about 100 bucks. I think he gave me a deal. I think he gave it to me a 90, whatever. But I like these canisters. I like keeping these. I like these. I like storing all my ammo in these. You got to keep a lot of ammo. You got to have these right here, man. You got to keep so. I got another one that, that I added to, add to the, you know, to the collection. So that's three sets of bullets right there. I got the nine millimeter. Uh, these right here. Some more nine millimeter that came in here. It's 115 grain. I think those are the 140, 24 grain. And then I got me some 38 supers. And this nice canister right here. Let's throw all that in. Uh, one more find I got. That I can show you because I don't feel like going outside too dark. Pick me up that 100 round drum for my AR 15. That 100 round drum. That 100 round, I said that 100. That 100. Yeah. Yeah, you know. You know, your boy stayed with the extra dose. You know, the extendies, the 50s. What my boy say? 30 round, 50 round, 100 round. Yeah, pussy bought them drums. <laughs> yeah, we got all that too. 30 round, 50 round. Let me pull out them 100 rounds. Pussy boy. How you praying like a nun? I ain't never been an actor. Hit the nigga with the cap of shit. We gonna stuff his ass like a cap. The mayor Bush call me master. This thing is nasty on here. This thing is nasty. Picking up the 100 round drum. Clear. There's some other colors in there. I just want to see my rounds. I want to see how many I got left. And I like this also. I like this look. Come on, man. Come on, man. Don't step on my property, Slim. Because this thing, I've known to tap some shit for about, from, from about 200 to 250 yards out. All right? So my property that big now, I tell your ass up 300 yards out. And you won't even know I seen you. I, I see you already. I be seeing you now already. I'm sitting on the top of the roof with the tripod out. You hear me? With the 100 round drum on that ass. I'm just sitting up there, dialed in on you. Just dialed in on you with the drum. So, yeah, this thing is nice. I ain't gonna lie. I like it. I like it. It looks good on my rifle. All right? It also looks good on my pistol. It do. I like it. Come with a little carrier case too, so I'm gonna show y'all that in, in a minute. I come with a carrier case and I also come with a loader. Like it a lot. I like it a lot. It come with a loader. I got this jump strapped all the way up. Bam. Look at that on the pistol. Look at that on the pistol. Huh? Got that hunting around on there. Talk to me. What you think? I told you, I told you we got the same thing. We got them. We got them third rounds. We got them fifty rounds. And we got them hundred rounds. Yeah, yeah, life was great. Just don't come around here playing around because I like to live. If you keep playing the on of you, you know, if that's not what you want to do, I mean, just leave me alone, you know? So these five, five, six. I'm gonna keep back with y'all. Five, five, six, hundred round drum. Oh yeah, I like this thing. Got the big titties. You know we got them titties or them drums, whatever you want to call them. Them drums or them titties, huh? So look, it comes with a nice little carrying case too, and it also comes with a loader. So this is the carrying case it comes with. Pretty dope. I didn't think it was going to come. I thought it was going to come in a box by itself. Bam. Nice little carrier case. Strap on it. Uh, take it with you. You hear me? It also comes with a nice little um, a loader right here. Because it's a lot of tension. It's a lot of fucking tension trying to load that damn hunting round drum. And they also work on my regular drums too. Yeah. 
puppy. So let me show you how this works. Let me show you how this works. A little five at a time. All right. So you take your mag. All right. Preferably the, the hundred round, but that's already filled up. And it's in here. See, a hundred round up in there. That's a nice little carrier case. And I like. I didn't even know it was gonna come in that box. Bam. All right. So what you do is you take this, your mag, and you take the loader that comes with it. I was a bonus. I didn't know it was gonna come with it. You load five at a time. Oh yeah, you know about them green tips. Five at a time. Probably do more. No, you do just bam. They in there. Fucking awesome. I'm thinking I was going to load them over by myself all the time with my hands all the time, but no. It comes with a loader. Go. What is that? R R W B. It comes with a loader. And the carrying and the carrying case. Come on, man. You can't beat that. You can't beat it. Just put the bullet in there. Facing the direction it's supposed to go. Don't be stupid. Alright? Put it in there. And that was in there. I think that's awesome. I think it's awesome. Thanks for the So yeah, man. Those are a couple of my fans from the gun show. You know. And I'll check with y'all later, man. This your boy Luso. This your boy Luxury Luso. This your boy the gun show. Happy New Year. Salute.